technically you're here for the same reason I'm here. And that is good. Is good? Well, $35 is most likely not. But if it holds a monitor, then maybe. I need a bigger desk. Should have cleaned up. So, up our stand. Seems pretty strong. Got mounting hardware for the monitors. And, I'm guessing, wow, it's lightweight. Death machine, it's currently in its Oppenheimer stance, ready to explode. Ooh, safety hazard. Uh, make sure, read and stand the instructions. Where did they go? That kid just got uppercut by a monitor arm. What does it say? Mount that to the bottom of that. Stick on a desk. Cool. I was expecting it to say mount the monitor before cutting it or something, but I guess not. Anyway, I am happy to uh, get knocked out by this thing. Any minute now. I don't think that bodes well for its weight capacity. It says 7 kilos, but unless you can tighten that. Mmm, yes, more disposable Allen keys. Oh, beautiful. Although, I don't understand how they can make something like this for $35. Um, all I need is a monitor in max up position as it's going on the server rack. So I'm not too fussed if it's crap or not. I intentionally less than loose so that the line and I didn't even listen to my own that's gonna strip my own advice. Hmm. Feel like I screw that in, see that's nowhere near straight. I'm going to strip that. Make sure they're tight enough to survive an earthquake. Instructions had something about a flush surface and a non flush. I think that's what this sort of space is. I don't know, that was flush to me. I didn't read the rest. So I'm assuming it slides on there like that. Put a screw in here. In there. Alright, that's installed. Ooh. Ooh. It looks like a river of some sort in there. It's got some interesting construction. Rivet there, don't know if that comes off. Oh, oh. The answer is yes. You can, yeah, you can tell it's cheap, but we'll see if it holds the monitor up. I don't see an adjustment. Oh, I do, right there. Um, I did also notice that has a minimum depth on it. And considering this is going on a server rack, that is very thin sheet metal, I'm going to have to pack it with wood. With that mounted, I now intend to install it over this slot here. Um, however, given that how thin this is, I've cut a block of wood that's going to go under it. We'll see how strong that it goes. I'm sure I don't break anything. Probably could have installed that first before putting it over, but it's not going to matter. All the threads on this feel really rough. Ominous cracking noises. Much stronger than I thought it was going to be. Doesn't look amazing, but it has worked. So here, fully installed. It has the cables. I thought they would go under this, but they don't. You just squeeze that like that. And then these clips come out so you can put them through. It's not 
nearest but not the worst. Then on the bottom side it's got a channel, a clip in there, they're already coming out. Um, this is broken ready, um, the clips broke off in the top, so that's wonderful. Uh, in terms of adjustment, there's one here that controls how much stiffness it is, so I guess you want it so it doesn't drop by itself, but doesn't go up by itself. So I've adjusted it so when you move it somewhere it stays, but I'm always going to have it at the top anyway. Um, and then in terms of swivel, it has little grubs there and at the base here. So if you want to swivel, you have to undo those grub screws with an Allen key that they have not provided. However, it is a 3mm Allen key. Um, so you have to loosen and tighten them in order to get it to turn. Yeah, but then, if you look at the play afterwards, very stable. Um, but it does the job I guess I certainly wouldn't want to be adjusting it up and down all the time so for $35 does it do what it was meant to do I guess um, I would not use it as my daily monitor arm for my computer actually look at that wobble um, but for a sev wreck something I'm not going to move it it's perfectly fine so would I buy again yes but not as a primary monitor. If you are looking to spend a little bit more and get a nicer one, these are, I think they're XCD from JB Hi5 and very similar in design but much better build quality um, and much more sturdy uh, and I've got two of them and they've lasted quite a while.